Yeah, uh, it's pretty easy to see, given the size of the truck, that it's not something you'd want to use for your right. work and hauling, but you can, you know, it still does right. have it, a flatbed yeah. that you can put stuff in. It, it'll do the job. So we'll take it back, mm -hmm. and we can actually probably even haul some more extra, like, raw materials if we want. Sure. If there's anything we need right now. Mm, is there anything else you guys can think of besides... The stuff that was listed on the Lowe's trip number one. Um, I'm not seeing the tubing there. The All hoses. Right. Other than that, it, that looks fine. Well, I man. have the hoses in mind. Okay. Grace is gonna uh, after you have everything packed in there, throw her bike on top of it. Yeah. Um. Uh, the uh. The actual cab of the truck. Really only has room for two. So two yeah. of you would have to ride in the back as well with the stuff. And Ace is not riding with Tony. A Ace, I mean, Ace is definitely riding in the back of the truck. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you, you can... Grace will sit in the well, back. If he well. doesn't want to sit in the... <laughs> nobody wants to ride in the car. <laughs> a a Ace well, will say that he would like to have more mobility <laughs> if something happens. <laughs> This way, if we fly off another bridge, you can go airborne. <laughs> that's how Chris Henry died. Uh, I'm sure that's how a lot of people in the South have died. <laughs> Tell me more. <laughs> it's a long monologue. Well, I guess you three are going to be riding in the truck, which now Ryan's going to have to go find a toy version of to find the picture. Does he? It it's, it's going to happen. harder to find than you think. Well, Tony's going to drive the Swagmobile with its grand minus five to his drive checks. <laughs> yes, well, at least there won't be a further penalty because of the stuff in it. <laughs> nope. It's empty. True. Let's just keep racking up the penalty. All right. Shoot uh, for the stars. If you two would, uh, if the group wishes to actually head back to Fort Drake, then, uh, we can, uh, certainly make that a possibility with uh, some drive checks barring the way. For uh, for Fletch, it would definitely just be a dexterity plus driving. Uh, the truck handles fairly well. For, uh, for uh, it'd, be, it'd be minus three, of course, given the road conditions. For Trusty Tony, it is the dexterity plus driving minus five. That is a yeah. It's not really a meow. <laughs> oh, oh, that that's a thing too. This is a truck we're driving, not drive car. <laughs> oh boy. Uh oh. <laughs> there is a separate driving truck skill. I refuse to acknowledge that. <laughs> On the it, basic the, principle it, of fucking seriously <laughs> does it also govern the dr the drive semi oh man each kind of vehicle car truck tracked vehicle How and stupid, motorcycle like, i'm pretty sure truck there means semi <laughs> I, I think so too i'd have to interpret check it, it up as that. because like the amount of skill points an <laughs> average person would have to use just to drive like normal vehicles would be stupid oh, what's the ribbons count as I, mean, I refuse to acknowledge that a pickup requires something other than drive car. <laughs> Just like fucking troll are you there for me? Drive car, drive van, drive truck, <laughs> drive coupe, drive sedan. <laughs> well, I mean, we got different into, like, real bases, man. We got into the guns conversation. Like, I still find week. that to be ridiculous as yeah. well. Like, each kind of vehicle, you know, car, truck, requires a separate driving skill. So, you know, like, hey, hey, it's a pickup truck. I see that, and then I see that they don't have one for van, which makes me it's think a, truck is similar. Well, semi. it says among others. Uh huh. Driving Japanese import. I'm pretty sure among others is like snowmobile. <laughs> Go kart. Uh, shit, you're fine. Ah. Uh, those are enough. Uh, you are able to navigate your way back to Fort Drake. On the conditions. That takes the swagmobile down to the danger zone in fuel. I will go drive this truck right into that river. <laughs> 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 and then cock it all the way down to DC. It's only 15 miles. 
You have to drive to Norad to get to. That's only 15 miles away, too. Uh, but yes, so we make it back. We'll Didn't this place get stripped? Um, yeah, more or less. Yes and no? Most of it's been pretty roughly stripped, yeah. Mm-hmm. As, make, as, make and do. As, as the truck continues to make progress, uh, Ace will end up radio in. Hey guys, we, uh, we got an extra. And Rick says, really? Do tell. We just did. And he says, "Look, look, we gotta, we gotta, do, we gotta pick up here. That's your extra." Like Rick sounds a little hopeful. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, yes, Rick. <laughs> Why don't you take some time when you t- finish looking at Fletch's helicopter and uh, come out and have a look? All right, <laughs> Rick says suspiciously. Rick just sitting there like, "What the <laughs> fuck do I care about a truck for?" <laughs> It must be the most amazing truck ever. <laughs> ever. <laughs> Eventually, let me go ahead and find Riggs. Riggs will, like, uh, walk out of, like, the helicopter area as you folks are, like, pulling up to the central, like, Twin Tower administrative buildings. And you can, like, see, you know, like, he has, like, a, like, his, like, hands extended. You know, like, his face, the one that you got for face is like, what the fuck? <laughs> Pretty sweet, huh? <laughs> oh. Ace calls out as the truck comes to a stop. See? Like I said, truck. This isn't a truck. Technically, it is, Riggs. It has its own driving skill and everything. Look, look, Riggs, I, I agree. This is not the ideal truck, but it, it has a bed. It's Tony's going to pull up and like, it's just loppy now. Riggs looks at the condition of the truck. Oh. See, she's still good. It's no. half on fire. And Ace, well, Ace, well, laughing, will grin and look out at Rig. See, look, and he'll start holding up things. We got chainsaws. We got PVC pipe. We've got bungee cords. <laughs> what about a tarp? You need a tarp, Riggs. Riggs like. <laughs> I have a feeling Riggs gives no fucks. <laughs> Riggs, like, passes a glance over the new person. Like, ah. Oh, yeah, and that's Grace. Ah. Say hi, Grace. Kind of, hey, points a finger at him and kind of smiles. Riggs, like, lowers his his head, like, to a hand and, like, holds his temples. All right. Um, you got a migraine there? I'm just going to go back to work now. <laughs> you probably don't want to, uh, you know instigate anything with him. He's kind of... I'll talk later. Ace, we will talk later. Ace, Riggs, like, turns around and slowly walks away. And, uh... Actually ends up being trusty Toady, who hears, like, a very murmured, I hate my life from Riggs. Toady's sure. not... Toady's just going... Shrug. Hmm. Okay. All right. Let's get to the. Let's see if we can get anything that's useful from these things. All right. Hmm. Go ahead and uh, trusty Tony's trusty Japanese import of five whole miles of fuel, inc- according to trusty Tony's very specific and trusty specifications. Yeah. He tasted it. It's good. Yeah. The fuel's good. Emergency lights on now and everything. Like, oh, hmm. check and probably been on for the last. Might <laughs> need to uh... service engine soon. <laughs> um, think we're good. And I need a minute. I'll be right back. I... Uh, hey, Fletch, how would you like a souped-up version of your uh, your little uh, Toyota there? I would rather it keeps working. It's gonna keep working. I'm just gonna rip apart the swag mobile for you. parts. You know, just tear apart the swagmobile. I mean, I don't think we need a Japanese so. import. Uh, you want me to... F- oh, okay. That's that's less cool, but okay. I, I could get around to doing that, I guess. Be right back. I need to feed my dogs. Sure. Why would, why would we 
<sighs> okay. <sighs> well, no, never mind. Never mind. First things first. Do we have what we need to uh, create a pump of some sorts? Maybe. We probably should have looked for a pump. But, you know. <laughs> we probably should have looked for a pump with a place that full of crap. But hey, hey, Ace like blinks like, you guys wanted a pump and you didn't look for one in there? <laughs> well, we, we got there and we saw everything else and we kind of got overwhelmed. We stuck to our guns. We were going to find We didn't this expect stuff. there to be this much like left. Yeah. I mean, I guess we can just go back and get a pump. I mean, we could. Will we go? You can you can go back. Maybe you can take. Yeah, I think I think we have enough stuff. We can start getting other things ready, and then just go get the pump. What do you want me to work on? Because I'm pretty sure Riggs is off moping or something. I don't know. And Potman's doing Potman things. What the fuck is wrong with this thing? <laughs> it's adorable. Look at it. <laughs> it's a wooden truck. If only Wait, it what? were red. <laughs> yes, oh, the the truck is the little pickup is cherry red. By the way. I can fix that. <laughs> paint it blue. Mm. There you go, so paint it blue. So... Let's spray paint. Oh, that's what I was gonna. Rem uh, we're gonna pick up. We're gonna pick up all the spray paint cans. <laughs> nah, you can you can jerry rig them into a flamethrower. That's. That's not scary or anything. Hey. I don't think there's Jerry rig. You just spray it in front of you and then hold up a lighter, right? Wink, wink. That's one way of doing it, but that... I was thinking of a more elegant solution for an elegant, elegant weapon. Jerry rigging equals elegant. Tell me more. <laughs> if I pick up the artist quality, it'll be elegant. But I don't have that. I'm not Pot Man. Trusty Tony, the artist. You'd have um... to explain that to me. <laughs> I'm trying to wrap my mind around all of this. Okay, anyways, we need a pump. But what else do we need? Getting a pump would allow us to fill up the truck, correct? And as far as we know, the truck didn't have any leaks, otherwise the acetone would have been leaking. Right. So... We don't need to line it with the tarps or anything like that, so we can just fill it with water. After it does the acetone That's the drying, idea, up. yeah. Mm. Just you know, leave it leave it open for a couple of days so it can evaporate and. Mm hmm. And then we use the pump, and then we go to the artesian well and pump water into it. Correct. Right. And then what do we do? And then we bring it back. And then do what? What's the I mean, I, I understand we have to get it downstairs, but how do we get it downstairs? Well, you do have your elevator that you've uh, rigged up that uh, could hold between, you know, maybe 50 to 100 uh, pounds safely. Mm -hmm. There's also the idea of running very long hoses before the elevator existed. We do have an, assort we do have an arbitrarily long length of hose, but I don't think that's long enough. No, no. Basically, you know, according to distance, it might be like, uh, it's not 15 minutes, <laughs> I heard, but, uh, and for a distance, it's maybe, with all the passageways that you'd have to walk through, maybe the shortest route could still be, I don't know, uh, three quarters of a mile to get to the horticulture labs. Three quarters of a mile. Hmm, I don't hmm. think we have enough hose for that. No. Probably, but, no, we probably don't have, like, 3,000 feet of... <laughs> no. Okay, so we're gonna have to probably empty the water into drums, maybe twenty-five gallon or twenty-gallon drums or whatever, and then lower them down the elevator. It definitely help if we found out how much water could even be held in the system down there first. Well, that'd be something for Potman to do, but Potman's off doing Potman things. Yeah. So let's just assume an arbitrarily large amount of water. It seems reasonable. Mm -hmm. Arbitrarily yeah. large amount of water. So, uh, water pump, huh? How's this water pump going to function? Like, uh, is it run on electricity? Like what? Well, is it going to be like hand operated? Hand operated would be the best because it'd be just a mechanical thing. Yeah, it'd be like just like a hand pump, basically. The best, huh? For mm -hmm. 80, yeah, I mean, eighty five hundred gallons of water. <laughs> I'm saying, I'm saying the best as we can be reused and the easiest thing to repair. 
Yeah. Trusty Tony would say the best one would be a uh, say like like the, the the artesian well water. You know, you would just like unscrew the cap and it would just fall out automatically. But it's pretty low to the ground, so you know you get your attachment there that could take it to slowly fill up the eighty five hundred gallon tank. That could take the, a long the while. The ideal situation would be to get some sort of construction vehicle where you can just throw a switch and the drivetrain swaps over to a pumping system. But, but that's not. not exactly what we have. Um, I also doubt we're not. Gonna, I also doubt we're going to find one of those anywhere nearby. It seems unlikely. Mm-hmm. So it's probably going to have to be a electricity powered pump to be able to fill up the tank at any reasonable length of time. Uh, that would be an item complexity, I would say, of challenging. It'd be a simple powered device. Hmm. Now I need to open up that book again and look at what That's challenging right. all means again. That, uh, yeah, the item complexity is challenging, and the, the difficulty modifiers for that, looking at my difficulty modifiers chart, is, uh, I would go ahead and give that the ubiquitous minus four. So mm. you're saying there's a chance. <laughs> so you're chance. saying that there's a chance. If you have uh, if you have uh, enough proper parts to cobble together a uh, water pump that would uh, you know would have to be powered, uh, but you could certainly make it. Well, yeah, we don't exactly have the electric motor right now, unless you want to take away take apart the shop vac, which won't have the power at all to fill you, it you, up. You could uh, basically attempt to. Uh, I could say you would we would make it difficult, and you could attempt to convert your combustion engine from the uh, Japanese Jesus import Christ. into a water pump, and we could say that would be a minus. Uh, we could say that'd be a minus six check. So I'm going to take the moment. So th- could I do this in parts? I know yeah. this probably this probably won't help, but I want to do it in parts. What are you talking about? Like I actually do the, instead of just doing the conversion and never mind. The thing I was theorizing is what we could do is you could do a gasoline-powered pump using one of the chainsaw engines. This is That's why not... I chose to bring two of them. <laughs> is that... Can you normally be stable? Uh, this you is could, a good day. You could certainly do that. It, that would still also be a minus six roll to your, uh, your check. It would also uh, definitely take some time. Um, I'm not exactly sure how much time it would take for the length. I would have to uh, look at complexity ideas. Mm. I would definitely say at least a day. Mm-hmm. Making a makeshift flamethrower on a car is a average roll. Is something average. Interesting. <laughs> mm, adapting a truck engine to act as an electrical generator? What the? Yeah. Okay. All you gotta do is tap into the alternator. Yeah, the alternator. It's the secret of a secret of a... Mm. No. I don't know why, but Map Tools is like, are you sure you want to exit? I didn't do anything, Map Tools. <laughs> <laughs> and let's see, that would be a mechanics with your intelligence uh, minus six. And you know what? I'll go ahead and uh, be generous about that type of idea. It would take you a full day. Like, uh, like you could get started working on it now, but you'd still have to spend the entirety of tomorrow, the 15th, working on it. Alternately, we could drive back to Lowe's and look for pumps. That's probably a better thing, because a minus six is... Well, worst case, what? You lose your chainsaw engine? You can pick up more chainsaws, right? He's got a point when he puts it like that. Worst case is much worse than losing the engine. <laughs> well, I mean, it's the chainsaw engine with some PVC pipe thrown in there. You know, you got you got to pull the water in. You know, and it's got a little bit of worst, worst case is that, end much worse than that. Worst case is that he fails, doesn't realize he fails until <laughs> you use the thing, <laughs> and you fuck yeah, up that's, the artesian that's more well. What I'm, that's more what I'm thinking of as worst case. Somehow it's going to go off like TNT. Well, hey, just, I just like I, seal I, the well. Hey. I devised a way to make TNT out of a chainsaw engine. 
the well has been fused. You can no longer get to the water. <laughs> Whatever, <laughs> Tony's doing it. Fantastically in the wrong do, direction. Do keep in mind that if you if you travel out, that will be like another 30 miles of gasoline you'll expend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, trusty Tony's not... Is but not the new trucks important. at like 75%. Yeah, we don't know. That thing's got like 5 miles to the gallon. I don't know. Yeah, but 70... Like, truck fuel tanks are usually at least like 20, 25 gallons. So really? 75% there's... A, even a small little Japanese import like that? Probably yeah. 20 gallons. All right. So while, I'm, I'm, while I'm sure doing this. it probably gets like 15 miles to the gallon, it has a lot of fuel in it. Yeah, I'm doing the whole, you know, charity yeah. thing. Because uh, uh, flip, flip, you, you would probably say that you could go maybe a little over 300 miles with the thing before it would run out of fuel. Mm -hmm. Worst case scenario is I do horrible irreparable damage to something. Average case scenario is it doesn't work. All right, I'm going to say 303 miles of fuel. <laughs> sure. That works Leap, for me. Look. Looks like Aaron's in the call, but no sound. Well. Yeah, he, he, he has some difficulty transmitting sound, you know. Sucks to suck, nerd. <laughs> you can, you guys can head out can and, you know, you look can. for that pump. I'm I can, yeah. yeah. It's up. Fucking miracle. Welcome. Oh, it's, it's a Christmas exists. miracle. <laughs> uh, welcome to uh, All Flesh Must Be Eaten, Aaron. I'm glad uh, you could... It's been like, what, a, a, a ten, nine-hour sojourn for you through the land of tech? Hell? It's been longer than that. It was before 6 a.m. when the problem happened. Shit. Who yeah. wakes up before 6 a.m.? This guy. <laughs> I did. I, I often right, do as let's well. Let's see if I can get map People tool are crazy. <laughs> Yeah, well, you're right. You I haven't even tried to launch map tool yet. Shit. If you touch Java, the whole thing seems Your subscribers well, guys, came back, you... Grimoth. <laughs> subscribers lost in the th subscribers lost in the th first three videos. The fourth one, you gained them all back. <laughs> and the truck is now red. It's cool. I noticed. I uh, went ahead and filled in its vehicle stats. Cool. Okay, I think my Java may be broken. You think your Java might be broken? That's pretty easy for Java to be broken. Yeah. <laughs> Situation <laughs> normal. All Java <laughs> up. <laughs> As a person whose job it is to work with Java every day, yes, it's very easy to break it. <laughs> 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 uh, ten of ten see. would break again. <laughs> let's go so about reinstalling you... Java because that's a lot easier than trying to find the problem. Yeah, I understand that for sure. So okay, you, you, you can, can you guys shit. can go off and find a pump at Lowe's. I'm gonna sit here and do awesome things. I swear to God, if something catches fire, it'll probably catch fire at least if once. It does, if it hasn't, I'm, I'm gonna go be disappointed. Here. <laughs> who, who wants? Who wants to go on a second uh, equipment run? I would recommend taking Potman just for Aaron's sake, but he's probably still off doing Potman things. He's getting high. It's okay. Uh, Ace, yeah. like, shrugs. That's never stopped him before. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's never stopped Ace shrugs and says, I guess, but I don't see what we could get unless you want to fill the bed again with more PVC pipe for I'm, Tony to fuck with. I'm thinking one thing is we can start... Like, I wouldn't mind grabbing a couple generators... That we could actually like move around if need be, um, and a bunch of wood. Sure, that would that would that's probably a big ticket item. The uh, truck probably couldn't hold much more than the generators. <laughs> yeah, I think like two generators would fill up the bed of that thing uh -huh. almost completely. Mm -hmm. And then uh, like some it's not a real fours. truck. It's like a baby truck. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My uh, mom had a uh, stick shift uh, pickup that she uh, she loved and adored, but you know. <laughs> Really couldn't haul that much. <laughs> no, they're they're lacking in the utility department. Yeah. But you know, it's more util useful than uh, that crunched. Than a up. crumpled <laughs> Japanese yeah. import rebuild. Uh, <laughs> as a recap for what happened, uh, Aaron, uh, these folks went driving to uh, search for a Lowe's or other hardware store, and uh, Trusty Tony rolled two ones on driving checks. So the uh, the Japanese import car got pretty fucked up. As well as all of the occupants. Yes. Especially Fletch. <laughs> took, they Mostly took, Fletch. They, they took 46 damage for falling. Even, like, even like, taking like 7 more damage than you, you're only 2 hit points ahead of me. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. 
Yep, yeah, yeah, Ace will bring that in. You know, he's looking at his injuries like, ah, maybe I can go see that Missy girl. I, his, his lips like crinkle up a little bit. I imagine I've got a pretty bad black and blue forming across the entire seatbelt mark as well as mm-hmm. like my side and arm and shoulder and everything. Mm-hmm. Thankfully, that doesn't affect your mood statistic in this game. <laughs> <laughs> he is doing pretty fucked up. Oh, his his Facebook status is upset. <laughs> Future Facebook status. His MySpace status is upset. <laughs> D- dismayed at Trusty Tony. <laughs> Does Trusty Tony even we have We can trust him to fucking jack up his vehicles. <laughs> Hashtag well, tony it up. <laughs> oh, tony it up. It's so close to total, I love it. Well, I'm going to do that roll secret jury rigging thing now. Yep. And because that, I, yep, that, that will <laughs> occupy Trusty Tony for not just the rest of this night. You will tell me if it blows day. up in my face, though, right? Yes. When it blows up, yeah. If, 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 it, it, if, if you do such a horrific job with it that it is a catastrophic failure, Trusty Tony will realize. If he starts asking for secret D tens, oh. then you know something <laughs> might be up. Aaron connects and Jordan rolls, and an unexpected error occurred. Fucking Aaron! As soon as you connect, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought Every I'd spread the love around, you know. Uh, fucking. Let me uh. Yeah, whatever. I-, I can't tell you how big of a deal it is that I am in a call and connecting to this right now. <laughs> like holy crap! Ten hours in the making. Ten hours in the mail. No, you said it's like 15 hours now. Your uh, mechanics is four and your intelligence is four, uh, Jordan? Okay. I want to make sure. Let me check my my character sheet. These things change randomly, you know. Okay. Uh, The the construction, we'll get to that since it will take you all of that time to do that. (laughs) Trusty Tony is busy. Does the extremely high pot man need anything from the hardware store? We were trying to think of because they got like the garden right. center, so we were. I'm going sure. to. Uh, oh, uh, so everyone's planning like another outing right now. I'm going to disconnect the server and rehost. Okay. I, I can't save anymore now with that unexpected error having occurred. Aaron has um, infected the entire system. One, Again. one thing I will say is, uh, whoever has control over Grace might want to save a copy of the token first. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm safe. Let me just grab uh, important stuff really quickly as well. Mm-hmm. Okay, but like I said, you guys are planning an outing right now? Yes. We just got back from the hardware store. We filled up the truck bed once, and we're about to go back while Tony's jury rigging some stuff. Uh, all right, Paw Man will ask what route you're taking while holding up a uh, map and a list of addresses. We like if you look on the map, if you're able to before this goes down, there's a red dot on the west of Brunswick, large hardware store. Yeah, I see. That's I basically see. where we found it. All right, uh, Popman will say, Can you swing by the fucking Brunswick library? Okay. Isn't that like downtown? It's uh, roughly in the same area, it's not downtown, it's north of it. Like, if you can't, you can't, then but yeah, if we, you can, can. we can try. I could use some books on gardening and I'm going to disconnect now. Okay. Here we go. 